Welcome back. We're here with Catherine Hungerford, and you're here just to talk about um, uh, Giving Trees. Yeah. And this is an annual event that the Missoula Agent Service has done. We've interviewed these guys about this many, many years, and it's to promote the dignity, independence, and health of aging adults in the Missoula area. Yeah, that's awesome. Is that awesome. right? Well, I think you just about got our mission yeah. done perfectly. Because so. I know mean, you guys always come in and you always yeah. do the mission, and if I don't, if I don't try to say it or tr attempt to say it, then it's like, it's all for naught. Yeah, that's true. So anyways, true. Uh, you guys are giving the gift that keeps on giving, and these are the giving trees. They and are. what can you tell us about giving trees? Well, they're pretty awesome. We have uh, trees set up around in the community, so there's a lot more locations this year, which is exciting and new for us. And it's a way for people to visit a tree, and you can take a tag and meet a real need of an older adult, you know, one of our older neighbors right here during the holiday season. So um, basic human needs like food through the Meals on Wheels program, you can take a tag and um, it can help you provide uh, hot, nutritious food for an older adults, you know, for a whole week or for 10 days or whatever you choose. So you can take the tag that, you, you know, is appealing to you. We have respite and homemaking services. So a lot of folks want to provide that for someone cool. else, especially around the holidays. And, of course, Giving Trees will be all over the, the town. I have a whole list of the tree locations. Yeah. Super of Montana. Orange Street Food Farm, Go. <laughs> Burton's Classic Hair, uh, MSO Hub, CAPS Office, County Administration Office, mm -hmm. the Missoula Public Library, you can't go, of course, the Missoula Asian Services has it there yes, as we well, do. Missoula Courthouse, um, mm -hmm. Missoula Animal Control, and of course, the Missoulian. So yeah. those are many of the locations that are having the giving trees. So one of the questions uh, also is, what are some of the programs that public can choose to support in giving trees? Mm -hmm. So um, we touched a little bit on respite and homemaking. So being able to provide that is awesome. We also have a foster grandparents program. So at-risk students in the schools can receive mentoring from a foster grandparent. And so um, you know, there's a tag that, that is for that. Or you can pick a tag to provide groceries. So to provide a grocery card for an older adult you know just it's a lot of times it's those you know really important needs and um, this is the time of year we glimpse into people's hearts and we see that goodness and yep. um, get to see the very best in people especially in the world that we live in right now it's just really really nice to see yeah and if you want to donate you can always go to missoulaagentservices.org sure. um, they have the tabs 25 50 100 500 or <laughs> other if you want to customize your own donation Yep, and we're just, we're thankful for whatever people want to do. We're just completely amazed at our wonderful community and thankful to you guys too for having us on. Yep, and let me also mention that uh, Missoula Union Services comes on here every month to talk about all the organizations that they provide people in the community. You know, yeah. like, um, they, you know, you were just talking with Hayden um, with uh, Washington, Washington. Children's, Shel Children's Shelter. You provided them 20 volunteers. So yeah. if you're a nonprofit, and looking for volunteers, uh, it's good to uh, shake hands and um, uh, what, uh, what's that called? Uh, collaborate. Collaborate, yeah. Yeah. touch elbows yeah. with the uh, Missoula Aging <laughs> Services. They provide a lot of volunteers, a lot of willing participants yeah. from many, many walks of life. It's true. And it's a, a great opportunity to get involved and also donate. So once again, uh, where can people find more information about uh, Missoula Aging Services? Sure, you can go to missoulaagingservices.org. You can also um, just give us a call. We have a call center, so needs are met immediately at 728-7682. Again, that number is 728-7682. All right. Well, thank you very much. Is there anything else you want to mention? Um, you know, just to express appreciation and thanks and gratitude to our community that makes our work possible. We're very appreciative. And to you guys, thank you. Yeah. Well, thanks. We'll be uh, right back right after this.